Hello, my name is Carmela Bakes. Viewer discretion is advised. This content that you are about to view may be offensive. If you are easily offended, then please do not watch. Thank you. Have a nice day. Okay, people, so we have a uh, DJ Diplo. You know what I'm saying? This, these, are, these are all new people. I, I don't you know what I'm saying, but I don't know these people, but I can tell you exactly what is going on, the reason why they do doing what they doing. See, Diplo is a worldwide recognized DJ. You know what I'm saying? In order to be a worldwide recognized, I'm, let's keep it go go back to the scriptures. The Bible says, "What profit a man who gained the world but yet loses soul? Or what will a man or woman give in exchange for his or her soul?" See, this world was given into the hands of the wicked, like the scriptures say. So in order for you to be recognized amongst the elites, um, uh, and uh, as in, only, in order for you to be recognized, of, you know what I'm saying, and to be spoken about amongst the other satanic scumbags, you know what I'm saying, in order for you to be even spoken about on the national media circuit, you got to have to pass your soul to the fire of the mola. So we have... DJ Diplo, he's a recognized worldwide DJ, but his baby's mama is not. His baby's mama is not. His baby's mama, well, now she's not. Well, now she is. Before she wasn't. You know what I'm saying? Because when these celebrities announce and bring somebody into their realm, into their world, and announce it, to the world, you best believe they just showing you that, hey, look, this is my ritual. Look, this is who I brought in. This, you know what I'm saying? This is what the elites, this is what they saying to the elites. They symbolically telling the elites, look, this is who I brought in. You know what I'm saying? This is the soul that I brought to you. Because, see, see, when you pass your soul to the fire of Moloch, what the main thing that Moloch wants you to do the main thing that the elites want you to do is go out and get souls. They don't care about money. You know what I'm saying? They don't care about nothing but you going out and getting souls. The same way Nicki Minaj went out and she got Kenneth. She's announcing Kenneth to the world. She's telling the elites that look, I got this guy. I'm grooming him up. He's going to be my sacrifice. You know what I'm saying? Juicy Smolak. I just did the news story on him. He brought his sister into the realm. You know what I'm saying? Look, this is my sister. You know what I'm saying? Now we got DJ, you know what I'm saying, Diplo. Bringing his baby's mama into the spotlight. And next month is Easter. What does Easter represent? Easter represents babies. Don't believe me? Why do they celebrate Easter? Man, let me tell you why they celebrate Easter. And it damn sure don't have nothing. To, it damn sure don't have nothing to do with Christ. But it got everything to do with Ceramicis and Nimrod. Ceramicis, another word, a name for Ceramicis, is Isis. You know. So ceramicists gave birth to this is all what before I get into this, this is all Egyptology, theology, philosophy. This is all African voodoo worship, which these elites worship, which these so called black conscience teachers pay homage to also. 
So Ceramuses gave birth to Nimrod, which is another word for Nimrod is Tammuz. Tammuz is the same thing your white Jewish people study out of. The, the Babylonian Tammuz. So Ceramuses gave birth to Nimrod, landed in the form of an egg. An egg popped out Ceramuses coochie and landed on the Euphrates River at Easter time. That's why you got all of these celebrities. That's why you got all these celebrities, you know what I'm saying, <clears throat> in a rush to show babies and having babies and saying that they're about to have a baby and all of this on Easter time because they are paying homage to ceramicists. You know what I'm saying? That's why you got on well, Easter time you got the bunny and then you got the eggs. What do eggs got to do with Christ? What do a rabbit got to do with Christ? Pay attention, people. None of them got nothing to do with Christ. But let me tell you something, people. It got everything to do with ceramics and Nimrod and Babylonian worship. So it's not a coincidence that this DJ is doing a heavy ritual by announcing that his baby's mama is black and he's expecting a child at the end. Because we're almost at the end of March. We're almost coming into April. We're almost coming into Easter. So it's not a coincidence that he's announcing that this, this is a big ritual. I won't be too surprised if something happens to his baby's mama before or after Easter. This is how these people get down. You know what I'm saying? And the reason why, you know what I'm saying, he announced that she's black because guess what? He's a DJ, right? He want to be accepted in hip-hop, right? Well, in order to be accepted in hip-hop, you got to be some type of blackish. Because black is hip, right? You know what I'm saying? I mean, you DJ music catering to blacks. I mean, I don't see you remixing a country song. I don't see you DJing country music. I don't see you DJing rock and roll. I don't see you DJing techno. I don't see you DJing any other genre of music but rappers. So, this is a ritual to bring this DJ more to be accepted amongst the black community. He got a ritual, he got a baby. This is what goes on in Hollywood, people. You know what I'm saying? It's more to it's more to it than just you know what I'm saying. Oh, I'm a my baby's mama's black. With with all that being said, I should just say you know what I'm saying. I should go out and date a white girl and say, oh my my baby's mama's white. Am I trying to be accepted in the white community? Come on, people. This is sickening. This is a ritual that's going on with this guy right here, people. A damn ritual. Anyway, this is news. I want to thank you all for tuning in and logging on to another episode of Luminati News Hour right here on Gospel Talk Radio. I'm your host. I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. If you are new to this channel, please tap that subscribe button. Hit that like button if you like this show. Hit that hate button if you hate this show. Hit that comment or leave a question or a comment on this show. Don't forget, check out Sister Carmilla Bates. She just dropped a brand new single off her debut album called I Am God's Greatest Creation. Available on Apple iTunes right now. Go cop that. Oh, you can check out her website. is in the description box below. The website to our podcast, weekly podcast, in the description box below. And also, the, our donation link is in the description box below. Till next time, stay tuned. God bless you.
to you.